Hi, I'm a dermatologist from Bangalore. My name is Dr. Rasya Dikshit. My special interest is laser and laser in dermatology. A lot of times when we do the lasers for the patients with acne scars, we say that the results are not equal. Everybody doesn't get the same result, though we are using the same lasers of the same parameters. So let us look at what are the factors which could affect uh, what is the success or what is the treatment outcome. First is the type of the scar. So a patient who has more superficial scars, pigmented scars, rolling scars tend to do better than a patient who has mostly ice pick scars or box scar scars or deep scars. The second is the amount of um, collagen which need to be developed. Okay, so if a person has lost a lot of collagen, the scars are very deep, then obviously they need more number of sessions and they need more aggressive treatments than a person who has more superficial scars. And these are something which everybody understands. Third thing which is very important is the color of the skin. So if the patient is a dark colored patient, the laser, though it is a very good laser, we cannot increase the energy beyond a point because we are worried that the skin will get pigmented. So again, in such patients, we choose microneedle RF based treatments or we have to choose to go with lower intensity but multiple sessions. The next thing is um, the age of the patient. So once the patient crosses 35 years of age, the collagen building capacity of the patient is lower. So obviously, you know, we are worried about whether they are going to get such good results. In such patients, we usually add on platelet rich plasma. Platelets, as you know, contain a lot of growth factors which increase the uh, tightness in the skin. So you can get better results. Other factors which affect this is what is the nutrition of the patient? Are they eating healthy? Are they stress free? Are they smoking? And are they having exposure to sun in peak sun at time? So all these things and working late nights, um, you know, all these things now affect the general health of the skin and therefore it affects your laser ka outcome as well. So if uh, we see that the patients in two to three sessions are not getting the desired outcome, the idea is to switch around the laser because there are more than one treatment available for the acne scars. So if the patient is on a carbon dioxide laser, see if we can switch them over to a fractional microneedle system and see if the collagen can be developed or add on a platelet-rich plasma treatment to see if the treatment can be uh, enhanced.